For this cutting method we are using a leg and chump of lamb. First of all we, we will remove some excess fat pockets. And next we loosen off the head of the fillet from the H bone. And this allows us to remove the H and tail bones as one. Once we've done that, we can remove the top side by following the natural seams, by pulling and cutting at the same time. And as you can see, by following the natural seams, the top side just rolls off. What I'm now going to do is to remove the rump by a straight cut. And also the shank. Once the shank is removed, we can trim excess fat from the remainder especially the pocket of fat which lies on top of the silver side next to the salmon and heel muscle. Take care not to cut the muscle apart. Once we've done that we turn the muscle block over and take a straight line from the bottom of the femur to the top of the femur to create a silver side joint and from this joint, which is a mini leg of lamb joint on the bone, we remove any excess fat. From this leg we have now created a lamb shank, a silver side joint, mini leg joint of lamb on the bone, lamb top side roast and a lamb rump roast. However, alternatively, the top side and rump can be cut into halves to create mini joints.